So what can you do if you feel like your career has hit a plateau and you're trying to determine what's next? Well, for some people, what's next is exactly what it sounds like getting to that next level. So they go after the next rung at their current company, a promotion, or at least a larger scope of responsibility. But for others, what's next means getting paid what they feel like they deserve. They want a raise, a bigger compensation package. That's what's next for them. For some people, it's a combination of those two things. And yet for others, what's next could be a completely different change in career. Maybe you're not 100% aligned with what your company does. Maybe you're not really all that interested in the industry that you're working in. Maybe you're at a big company and you want to try working at a startup or vice versa. Maybe you're not crazy about your boss or your colleagues and you want to change the people that you're working with. So what's next for you might be focusing on different areas than compensation or title. And then finally, What's next might mean something personal. Maybe it's not about a professional move. Maybe it's about bringing more personal fulfillment in your life, perhaps getting back to that hobby that you forgot about or pursuing a personal best type of goal. The point is, is that getting to what's next isn't just about defining the specific step but it's really about first defining what criteria you're going to use to determine if the next opportunity or the next goal is something worth pursuing for you. So you need to decide what are the decision factors, what are the criteria that I'm going to prioritize to determine what my next move is. And until you do that, you're not going to be able to target what you really want because how will you know how to get what you really want when you don't know what that is? So focus not just on determining the next step in terms of action or the next step in terms of what that job might look like, but really think about what are the decision criteria that you are going to use to vet that next step. Let me know how it goes once you do that. I'm anxious to hear.